this old guy idea why video has to do with transforming an old car hood into a skid plate for dragging logs and trees out of the woods. Now some guys use skidding cones, I know other guys use arches, but the thing I've used over the years that worked successfully was an old hood. So this one is from an S10, based on all those marks. Looks like somebody tried to open it with an axe. And because the front of the hood is all beaten up like that, I'm going to drag with this side towards the tractor. So to start this adventure, I identified where I want my shackle to go through. And I drilled a couple of 3 8 inch holes. And then I'll go in with a step drill and auger them out so they look like that. And then, working from this side, I'll stick the shackle through so it sits up like that. And then when I'm hauling wood, I throw the front end of the log onto this platform, run the chain beneath the shackle, and then the thing will tighten up as I'm towing, and it'll protect the grass anyway as I'm dragging logs from one area to another. It took a little bit of work with the sawzall and the step drill, but I got the shackle through. Now I'll flip the thing over the way it'll be used in service. And when I'm dragging the logs, the chain will come from, from the tractor under this shackle, and then I'll go around the log here, and this thing tightens up. It pulls the load tight against this, and then I'll have this hood uh, spreading the load over the, the grass and the woods rather than just having a log dig. So I'll be using this thing in a couple days and I'll take a video of it in action and show you how it does. Now this is the way I lay it out when I go to build the load. I'm just hauling all this crap wood here right now. So I throw my chain with that uh, big clevis hook on it and throw the chain across there and I'll pile up the logs and then choke it down. So this is the first load and you see that silver chain with the big hook went around the middle and then I hooked that other chain down through the clevis and to the drawbar on the tractor and now I'll drag these things back where they're going. This end, the logs are just going in this pit to be burned at a later date. So I'll just unhook the chain and then bring the tractor over, just push the logs in with the loader, go back to the next load. Now, this one is the last load for tonight. See, the process is the same. Run the big clevis hook so the silver chain will choke up. Down there, through the clevis in the car hood, attach it to the tractor. And that's the load. Thankfully it's almost dark. I told the lady that owns this place I'll work until dark. So I'm going to take a little time to get this one back to the pit. And it'll be all over for today. Have a good night.